Hey guys, Dragon Rider Jack here, and welcome back to Pokemon Emerald. Um, my one African American friend kept complaining that my Pokemon were all capitalized, so I lowercase them for him. But I also wanted to show you how I did that. And unlike in the first game, where after you changed Pokemon's name once, it was set forever because the name raider guy liked his own name so much that he was like, <laughs> I'm not renaming that, that's the best name ever. So in this one, it's in Slateport, right where I was, just to the left. Uh, Fortune Teller names, you want me to rate a Pokemon's nickname, and then he asks you which one you should critique, so I'm just going to do here, and uh, yeah, it's quite a fine name, but he has slightly better name in mind for you, and then you just get to pick anyway, so, uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, hmm, I could do it for the next Pokemon, but for this one, I was thinking about renaming him to Fire Poop, and I think I'm going to, because Flamer makes him sound gay. Fire poop is much more badass. Badass. Fire poop. And it means that he shits fire. Not that he is a piece of poo. And you can change it anytime you want. Like if I, sorry, for example, now I can just set, uh, rename him. Like he's gonna be like, ooh, fire poop is fight night. quite a fine name. But what if I give you an even better one than the one I gave you last time, huh? Huh? So, uh, yeah the hell oh hello jack this is roxanne of ross Ball city i heard from barney that you're moving up in the ranks of trainers as an incredible clip well i'd rather not think that i can't beat you i promise i shall i will shape up my gym so that you may you may challenge us again i hope you'll be looking forward to that occasion as much as me can you redo that can you do that how did she get my poke in avenus Anyway, you can come here now, but there's, like, nothing. You can't get in. I think this is, yeah, a long line. <laughs> but you actually have to come down here and talk to some guy. Is it this guy? Nah, it's not this guy. All right, get away from me, dude. I think you actually have to go inside. So this is, like, the shipyard where you can come way later, but not right now. Uh, this is the guy you gotta talk to, I think. I did reposition re my computer now. Uh, I just killed two ants in my room, and apparently they're carpenter ants, which is horrible because I live in a log cabin. So in about a week, I'm not going to have a home. Um, but I repositioned it so that it's on this thing. Like uh, it's on it's on one of the, the one of my holders, not a holder. It's on like a laptop like thing that you're supposed to use in bed, like a stand, and which it was on before, but only on the ground. Now I'm just sitting on the corner of my bed. Oh, it's empty. What? 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 No, I figured that'd be empty. It's trash. At least it's not full of vomit or something gross. Let's talk to one guy up here. Whatever. A big building that can float. Anyway, you just have to talk to that guy, and then that long line is going to disappear. And... I wonder if she's going to say something different now. I guess that's what she says, except when there's a gigantic line. Not like she wants to get in or anything. She just complains about it. Anyway, it costs you 50 polka dollars, so you gotta be a rich man to come in here. And you see, talk to this guy. And he's gonna be like... Uh, please don't beat my ass again. Don't, don't spank me like you always do. And he hopes he never sees me again. Coo. You can talk to all these people, there's no point though, you're not gonna fight them yet. You can look in here, they got stuff. Yeah, it's... I don't know, it's just random pokey items. And I think this is a fossil. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, I don't need some bio lesson. This is gross. I already took bio. And then... Is this can That's not a cat. Well, this is the only guy... Why do you... No, you can't be stern. You look like a scientist. And then both of these assholes come up and fight you. So this is the same as the last game. Because this I remember. Oh, Corvetta. This one was actually really cool, so I shouldn't be making fun of it. And damn it, it's also a dark type. So... That's, that, that sucks. Uh, <laughs> if it's team... Team Magma that you're facing, they have, uh, they have, um, Numels, the little camel fire, the fire camel guy, 
Alright. Also, with this guy, his special ability is... I'm pretty freaking sure is... Uh, is rough skin, so if you physically attack them, you get hurt a little bit. So use special attacks against the electricity, grass type moves that aren't physical. Which, there are some moves that you can't really tell that aren't are physical, you know, but you'll learn. And I want to get through here because our next team member is up above here, but you gotta do this first. Well, I mean, I don't know if you have to do it first, but you should do it first, I guess, because it's right there. And he went down, he cried like a little baby. You can see him crying, the tears streaming down his face. Oh, sniveling wimp. Wow, you're so mean to your best friend. And I'm sure that you two were best friends for since childhood. Because you guys are pretty much twins. It's crazy. Ah, and Routes can do something. Should be good against a Zubat. So I planned ahead, you see. Uh, if you have a move that, that flinches and you're slower, if it's gonna cause a flinch, which I think is like a 20% chance or something, a 25% chance, you'll go first, so you'll know if it's gonna flinch if you're like, using like, I don't know, the slowest piece of crap on the planet and it beats out like a Crobat. Uh, yeah, Crobat. Whoop, wait, what Pokemon did he say? I'm just gonna say no. Aw, oh, damn it. I should've figured that he would have one of these. So I might as well just show you that it is dark, it's not going to affect it. Yeah. Which I don't know why I showed you that. I mean, I just told you. It's not like you're not going to believe me. At least I hope you'll, you'll believe me. Otherwise, I don't know. Also, uh, something I should say about my names is that... When I come up with names, I do them strictly for humorous purposes. Like, I try to make them as funny as possible or as cool as possible. I don't really name them after people. So like I know it, like some people are like name it after me, some LPers name it after their name them after their friends and stuff, but that's not really my style. Something else, oh my god, I keep forgetting this. I'm in part ten and I finally remember. There was a um someone, and I'm gonna say his name because his YouTube channel is like a weird thing. But his name is Andrew Griffin. So hello Andrew Griffin, you sent me a PM a while ago. And he told me this story and it's quite sad. So I thought I would just mention him because he asked he asked if I would, and I mean, if you make up a story like that, just so me with like 900 subs will mention you in one random video that 50 people will be watching, then you know, more power to you, buddy. Oh my god, look at this guy, he's unique, he has a unique face. I came to see what was taking so long to snatch some parts, and you simps are held up by a mere child. We are Team Aqua, and we love the sea. And I am Team Aqua's leader, Archie. What makes you interfere with us? No, you can't be. You're not one of Team Magma. Wait, that can't be right. You're not dressed for the part. Pokemon, people, our life depends on the sea. So Team Aqua is dedicated to the expansion of the sea. Don't you agree? What if we... What we are doing is a magnificent undertaking. Ah, fine. You're still too young to understand our noble objective. But I warn you, don't even, don't even consider interfering with our plans again. The consequences will cost you dearly. And don't you forget it. And then they ninja, ninja vanish. Yeah, good, I got, I, I gave you the Devon goods, yeah. You sucker. Mother, mother pooper. Yeah, thank you. And they heal you because you can't just run out to a Pokemon Center. That's what that noise means, by the way. I hope you can hear it. I actually, no matter what I recorded, no matter what volume my Mac is at, which is at the lowest possible volume it could be, computer volume-wise. Hey, I'm sure, I'm sure I met you somewhere before. Have I introduced myself to you? Uh, my name, it's not, if not, my name is Scott. I just saw Team Aqua run away from here like they were stung. Let me guess, you drove them away. Hmm, maybe just maybe this trainer. All right. I think you're going to become a good friend. So let's register each other in our Pokenavs. Because that's what best buddies do. What I'd like you to do is a tag along with you, but I don't I do want to keep an eye. On the talents of other people too. So I'll be off to roam other towns a bit more. Be seeing you, Jack. Thanks, dude. I miss him already. I grew accustomed to his presence. 
Let me just make sure he did actually heal me. Yay, he did. Okay, I gotta reorganize some, some poopers over here. Especially fire poop. Because he's my favorite. He eats, he eats gasoline and shits flamethrowers. I don't know. Uh, one more thing to do in this town. Oh, I'm not reading this guy again. After all, oh, fine, I will. Damn it. I just say that and then start reading it. After all, a tough trainer is a perfect fit for the battle tent. Give it your best effort. Good. You can come in here, and I think it's this one that gives you um, what you need. No, clearly not. This is a Pokemon content. Wait. This is a battle place? This is a battle tent? They used to be Pokemon contests. Did they get rid of that? In the other games, uh, in not Emerald, it was Pokemon Contest. This was like the Hyper Contest. Torment's kind of cool. It doesn't if Pokemon uses it. Info. I don't know what this is actually. No. I'll do that later. Uh, I gotta remember to do that. But, let me see. I forgot to move it over. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, the white doesn't hit it. That's weird. Alright, I'm at 11 minutes. I don't know if I should even go up. I want to catch my next team member, though. And it's up here. Oh, I don't want to I don't want to battle that guy, though. Let me just see if I can find it. Uh, dun, dun. It's definitely not a dish, because a dish is gay, and I hate it so much. Get away from me, Oddish, you stupid. Let me see what else is here. I almost, I think it's all one. It's all one route. So I mean, they sh no matter what, it should be here. Here it is. Here it is, and it's male. Good because I am a sexist and I hate females, but I love the boobies. So, mud slap should work. One. I don't know if I have any pokeballs. Oh, Shiza. I probably have one great ball. I probably have one great ball. I really gotta start. I am just. You know, shitting all over myself in these past few recordings with, the <laughs> with these freaking mistakes, man. Uh, something else I did. Uh, I might as well talk about it while I try and catch Le Pokemon. But, um, something else I did was this guy, Nintendo LP. He's kind of cool. You can check him out. He does, he's doing Pokemon Snakewood. Um, like, just Nintendo LP. That's, like, that's, that's his name. Ah. Uh, I'm gonna try Tackle. <laughs> He's doing this thing where he'll give shoutouts to anybody, and even if you don't make LPs, you can like make a video and shout out some other LP here, and he'll do it. Like if you want to shout out someone else, well, I made a video for him to shout me out because I don't know. I mean, I might as well. He offered, and it's kind of cool him to offer because there's a lot of people that'll just be like, "I'm gonna try Pokeball." There'd be a lot of people that'd be like, "I don't give shoutouts. I'm gonna block your ass for cause you asked me." I mean, I never ask for a shoutout, but he's offering to do this for LPers, for smaller LPers. And that's a cool thing, so I thought, you know, what the hell, I'll just make a video. It's like a minute, a minute video. Mine went to a minute and 15 seconds, because a minute is surprisingly short for, like, introducing your channel to the world. But, hope, you know, hopefully that, uh, that will get some more people to notice me. I don't know. I like being noticed. Good. Now, I have a name for this one. Uh... It's more of a uh, NDS Chan, I remembered. <laughs> this is kind of the name that I'll, that's how you get the symbols, by the way. <laughs> I kind of I kind of thought about doing this. I don't know. This is just this is just for for fun, but I, I don't know if this is what I'm actually gonna do. But Vince is gay. Uh, that's for a specific friend who's named Vince. Uh, <laughs> but um. I'm actually gonna just end it off here, and I will... This is our last team member for now, at least. Uh, I'll, I'm gonna end it off here, and if I decide to name something else, I will... Uh, I'm gonna change in between parts. So thanks everybody for watching, uh, and I hope to see you next time.